Pro streamer, everyone. Pro streamer. All right. Everyone settled in. Hmm. This is quite the right hand yet. Let's turn us off a bit, shall we? That's too much. Let's go orange blue. Be sincerely wonderful. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to today's stream. My name is Decap Video, and I am primarily a video game streamer who primarily plays RPG games such as Kenshin Impact, Monster Hunter, Undertale, Inotopia. But today we're playing a different kind of RPG game because it's October, or at least it is when I'm streaming slash recording this, and. uh Yesterday was about the grinding hell of Genshin. Today we'll be focused on an RPG Maker game created by the lovely YouTuber Rong Rong. Go give them a follow and subscribe, they make some really funny animations. Um, and I'm gonna be honest, I have very little context. I know it's based on their comic, but beyond that, I'm a little bit lost. Belt Academy of Arts, Campus 3, 5 p.m. Ooh. I don't have a voice, I just realized. It's gonna be a bit more difficult for me to do voice acting. <laughs> oh, we'll do our best. That's that, huh? Red hair, glasses. Seems to match our profile here. My name is Anne. I'm a freshman student at Delta Academy of Arts, majoring in digital arts. My class has ended for the day, but I found myself turning to the campus as I have left my USB flash drive at the school. Alright, yep. It's RPG Maker, baby. So, arrow keys to move, Z to act, X for the menu, shift to run. Well, good thing for me, I'm already auto running. You can save your progress at any point in the game by going to the save tab in the menu. Save often. And make separate save files if you're going for multiple endings. You can adjust the volume, other settings of the game, and the options. So, I think I'm going to go for a purely blind run here, just for the first run. Um. Assuming that there aren't any like early deaths that happen in the game. And then for multiple endings, we might do like some you know additional runs after that. If Anna, if Anne's quest here turns out to be too short of a game for the entire month of October, I do have um, another game lined up. I'll head home after I get my USB drive back. Oh, I can actually click the next to the mouse. That? That's a bit strange. But I won't, you know, worry about it. Welcome to Delta Academy of Arts. The exhibition hall is always open for public viewing. We hope you enjoy your visit. Opening hours are 8 a.m. to 9 p.m., but we are closed on public holidays. Campus party on the 31st of October. Oh, I guess we're a little bit early. It's currently the 3rd of October when I'm streaming. Missing Charlesworth. Missing Myra Hess. Missing Hana Itagaki. So if you reverse Charles Worth name here, would he be worthless? Or worth Charles? <laughs> uh, Alright, the bad joke out of the way. Oh, that's a menu, right? You! Hello! Do you have any other classes today? If you're done for the day, remember to leave the school premises before 9 p.m., as stated in our student code of conduct. You have around four more hours before the school closes. Okay, I wish I could say that like that cool voice coming out of me naturally, but it's actually because my throat's closing up because of my cough. Have a good day! Oh yeah, that that 
That is an obvious proof. Like, my voice is cracked there. Okay, is that the same? Hmm. Maybe I should turn off Auto Dash. It's so soothing. I wonder if I can compose such beautiful music for my final year project. Okay, I can do shift if I don't want to, you know, run past people. How does artwork even make it to the exhibition? It's so fugly. But you know what they say, art is subjective. Or maybe I just don't want to sign art at all. I want air. <clears throat> nope. See, I can't even go for my high voice. I usually go for. I want. I wonder. How do they decide on which artworks are displayed for the exhibition hall? It doesn't always have to be the best, the best, right? I know this because there's some really awful artwork on display, like this one. Okay, there's a shotgun's gun now. This is gonna chase me at some point. Like, what the hell is this? Every year, one artwork is chosen from each department to be displayed in the exhibition hall. The student whose work is displayed is always guaranteed a good career in the industry. Even if they didn't pursue a career in art. Oh, it's good for the resume, I guess. I have finished my project, and I need to use my sewing machine in the fashion department's work room. I wish we could stay longer in the school, but, you know, the 9 p.m. school rule. Why aren't they allowed to stay here overnight? I know there are schools out there that are open, like, 24-7. Yo, what's up? Don't mind me. I'm just waiting for my friend. Okay. Let's not. Let's not do that. Huh? <laughs> okay, what was I doing again? Uh, getting my USB drive from the computer lab. Long quarterly in campus too. Now I think about it, I've never been to campus too. But then again. Oh. <clears throat> but then again, I have no business there. I should really go to the classroom and keep my USB flash drive. Any chance you can tell me like what floor it's on? Exhibition hall, parking lot, fashion department, sculpting department, piano department, digital arts. I haven't finished my assignment, and the deadline is approaching fast. I wish we could stay in the school longer, but of course, we have that stupid 9pm rule. Why can't they make an exception for the fashion department students? Not everyone has a sewing machine at home. It's the fashion department classroom for the third year students. I can hear the rhythmic sound of the sewing machines. Okay, so at this point, you probably already realized that the, the audio here cut out. But I just wanted to point out this person really freaked me out. Uh, this is someone known as Fiorin, um, someone who makes cameos in Wrong Wrong's videos. And she is uh, from uh, his manga all the way back, like a good 10 years ago now. Just wanted to point that out because it's really cool. And also, um, yeah, for any dialogue moving forward, you're basically going to hear me just doing ADR. Why is this pile of chunk still here? That mess has been there for almost a year. Is anyone going to clean it up? Come on, Bill. Open the door. This is not funny anymore. There's a rumor circling around the department. It's about the music piece that's playing in the exhibition hall. 
They said that he was actually stolen and composed by someone else. Yeah, what brings you back up here? Looks like things are arranged here like a normal school with a computer lab. Oh. Now hopefully we don't stay in too late. There's some time left for the school day ends. Maybe I can do some work before I go home. Oh no. She's definitely gonna stay here past 9 p.m., isn't she? Please get out of the school now. Please get out of here now. Come on. <coughs> All clear. I'd better get out of here. Right, so just missed us. Oh, here we go. Oh no, it's already midnight. It's way past the school's closing hours. I'm so screwed. Here. No signal? Never mind. I should talk first. The game is almost a feature. It used to continue from where you left off after encountering an untimely demise. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna have to use that a lot. Oh. Um. Uh. Yeah. It's only fine. Yep. Mm hmm. What happened to the school? It's a painting of a teenage girl. There's a small note written below the painting. Mira Hess. Oh, okay, so that's the first victim. It's a painting of a young man. There's a small note written below the painting. Charles Worth. It's a sinister painting. There's a small note written below the painting. Hannah. So my thinking here is that, um, well, Black painting. There's a small note written below the painting. And. Oh. Yeah, so my thinking here is that this is actually like the people who were in the missing poster at the beginning of the game, right? Um, I'm thinking like maybe this is where they all end up. Oh, hello. Uh, that, that's probably fine, right? Oh, um, yep. Mm, I'm just gonna worry about that, I guess. <laughs> yeah, just gonna keep on going. A piano. Okay, gonna keep on going again. Ready, go, so. Final year project for the music department. Piano. Team Purloin. Students have blank proposed their own. Uh, music sheets have to be submitted on. Final grades will be given upon something or other. I don't know. Okay, so. Probably just scratch out because it's not really important information here. I'm guessing anyway. Some of the words are missing. I'm just gonna go ahead and um, save here. A sheet music. Something. Oh. Well, um. Hmm. <laughs> yep. Hmm. Good thing I saved there, huh? Alright, let's get back in.
Okay, so what's that over there? Alright, that's a key, I think. Something on the floor. Obtain the piano key. Hey! That's mine! Where do you think you're going? Thief! Shoot, run, 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 run. So yeah, running from the piano made me realize maybe I could outrun the other one. Be very, very quiet. I'm hunting for what? Hmm, nope. Just gonna run, just gonna run. Is it still following me? Is it following me? Nope, I think I'm safe. Repeat after me! Hot cross buns? You know? There you go, should be right. Excellent! Right, moving forward. Okay. Right, just want to double check something. Um, okay, let's go here. A piano. Some of the piano keys are missing. You place the missing piano keys on the keyboard. Hmm. Okay. See nothing. Nothing. Okay. Uh. Just gonna save. Okay. Nope. Yeah. There it is. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right. Just gonna. Ah, okay, yep. Whew. Yep, piano's playing itself. Oh, someone's playing the piano. Hmm. Okay, that's kind of out of tune. Hmm. Maybe I need to slow down at this part. Yeah, this part is tricky. Hello? Oh, hello. Sorry, I'm quite busy right now. Wait, you shouldn't be here. Oh no, oh no. You remain the square for 9pm? You shouldn't have done that. Anyway, I'm your Hess. I was a student from the piano department. Listen, I know you're confused about what's going on with the school, but you need to get out of here. Now. Exit this room, turn left, and go down the stairs. There's a piano blocking the way, huh? Well, that's weird. There should be nothing there. Hmm. Uh... I 
I've heard his music before. Huh? What do you mean? This is the music that was playing in the exhibition hall. Possible. This is my original work. I composed it, but before I could submit it, I was trapped here. Wait. Unless... Ivy. Right. I... I knew it. That bench. I... I understand now. That day. Before I was trapped here. She drugged me and... She stole it! <laughs> oh, just a... Uh, just a jump scare. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> yep. Just gonna start running now. I have to get out of here. You know, seeing as there's no audio, I'll spare you the um, 10 to 15-ish minutes of me doing trial and error trying to get to this next part. And then I'll cut into like pieces in between because that's going to be a whole thing. Exhibition. Oh well. Whoever is reading this, keep calm and don't panic. I'm a security guard working for the school. Just stay exactly in the place where you found this and yell, security, as loud as you can. I'll come to you and help you out. Uh-huh. Oh no. Hey, wait. Calm down. I'm a human, just like you. You're not one of them, right? I'm a security guard working for the school. I can help you get out here safely. Exposition dump. I see. Hey, just, you know, putting things in here. Hmm, man, was it? All right, where do I begin? I know this sounds crazy, but this school is cursed. Every midnight, the school transforms into this nightmare that we're experiencing right now. The layout of the school randomly changes every night. Unexplained things happen to each of the school's departments. Have you seen those moving pianos? There are more of those on the lower floors ahead of us. You must be wondering how and why, right? I'm afraid I'm just as good as you are. To protect the students and the school's reputation, the principal kept this play a secret. The principal? Yes, he knew about this. In fact, we're investigating it together. You knew about the 9pm rule, right? That rule was made precisely for this reason. And if something were to happen to you, or if you lost your way in this place, well, you'd become a permanent resident of the school. Anyway, the school always returns to its normal state when morning approaches. And everything returns to normal as if nothing happened. Well, that's the gist of it, I guess. That being said, we should really get moving now. If you have any more questions, I'll answer them along the way. 
For now, let's find a way out of this place. What is your name? Hmm? My name? Uh, look, my name's not important. Just call me security or security guard like everyone else, okay? Why don't we just wait until it's morning? I know. Let's just hide and wait till morning. Yes, we could do that, but trust me, it's better to just get out of the school as soon as possible. Why? Well, there's a dangerous entity that roams around the school. Girl. We have to keep moving to avoid meeting her. Staying in one spot's a bad idea. Besides, there are no good hiding spots when everything else is alive and out to get you. How long has this been going on? Hmm. I'm not sure. It's been a while, but I don't know when exactly. You might want to ask the principal about that. After we get out safely, that is. Hmm? What is it, Anne? Oh, the paper. Yeah, that's mine. I made lots of those and I scattered them around the school. There are at least one or two in each department of the school. The school changes that every night, so the position of the paper may be different from day to day. What? You didn't find any copies of the paper in the town department? That's odd. Chapter 2 The Sculpting Department Hang on just a second, I have to fix some things here on my end. A clay statue. A clay statue. A clay statue. A clay statue. Wait, was this door here before? He tried knocking on the door. No response. Nope. Mm -hmm. That's probably fine. But before I proceed. There's some statues going around this floor. Not friendly. So be sure to keep away from them. Just gonna save here real quick. And done there. Moving up. Oh, hello. The four headed serpent. The six legged beast. Pile of clay. The hand of one. Okay, so it's probably important for later or something. Mm hmm. Yep. Cafe. Statue without a body. Leave me alone. Hey, that was through. We can sign the floor. No, go away. Leave me alone. Alright, guys, same dialogue there. Door's locked. There's a note written on the door. Success. Let's check the room behind us. Hmm? The sculpture's blocking our way. No worry, Anne. I can push it out of the way. Leave all the heady duty work to me. Alright, Mr. Strongman. <laughs> yeah, once again, we're just gonna go ahead and skip ahead here. This puzzle took me a while and I had to restart the room a couple of times just to get through it. Let's just say it didn't just take five minutes. Okay. There. And something on the floor. A pan of clay key. Save, 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 save! Okay, finally we solved it. Jeez Louise, that took so long. Okay, how do we get out? Uh, hang on. Let's save here again. Uh, 
Okay, yeah, I was overthinking it. Door's locked. There's no run on the door. Success. You use the key to open the door. Let's get the out. Mm -hmm. Bunch of stuff around here, a little on the floor. Art sculptures and stuff. Final year project for sculpting department. Theme, success. Type of clay, great clay. Minimum size is... Eh. Final grades will be given upon... Ketangtan. I don't really know what to say here. Just filling in random words to the blanks. Also, same with the ADR here because I'm also, you know, filling in myself with blanks. Some of the words are missing. The key to success are hands, legs, bodies, heads. Huh? What does that mean? Oh, got it. Alright, so, just had to switch some parts around, but basically we got the code. <laughs> A clay statue. A clay statue. Oh, Mr. Security! Are you still patrolling the halls? How are you? It's been a while, hasn't it? I'm fine. Listen, I need to go around the side of the floor, but the way is blocked by your friend. That pile of junk. Is there anything we can do to convince him to move? Oh, him. Uh, please don't call him a pile of junk. He was once a beautiful statue. If only you knew the story of what happened to him. Anyway, I think you'll have to convince him to move him if you fix him up. He's in a pretty bad shape, after all. Here, take this sculpting tool and fix him up with some clay. You can get clay out from some of the clay piles running outside his room. Clean sculpting tools. Good luck! From here on, this is going to be my actual voice in a couple um, seconds here. So, I just wanted to say... Um, to any of you who made it this far into the video, thank you so much for watching and you know sitting through this. I, I know it's not super great to um, you know see that disconnect between my lips moving and the things I'm saying, especially because a lot of it is just me extrapolating um, what I would say based on my own speech patterns. But I appreciate that you know you stuck through it and you made it all the way here. And as a little treat, there are some things here that I end up saying or doing that are pretty cool in my opinion though I'll admit I kind of gave up on editing it like hardcore after this portion so from here on enjoy the rest of the video with the actual audio recording um poor quality and all guys not the webcam it should be the microphone which isn't being registered Gosh, how long has the microphone been off? Ah, that sucks. Oh well. What can you do, right? I guess my voice acting talents, which um, were already kind of muted by me being sick, are just gonna have to kind of fall by the wayside here. Yeah, just a happy-go-lucky game with some not-so-scary ghosts. It's made by an indie, um, I guess any developer, but they're more like an indie animator, to be honest. If you haven't seen any of Wrong Wrong's work, um, they make some pretty fun, fun games over it. Uh, fun games, fun animations over on YouTube. I actually have the name spelled out in my, um, my title, Wrong Wrong. Should I play FNAF? I don't know if I can handle that. <laughs> 
not because it's scary, mind you, but because um, I'm not sure if you're aware of this. There is a game mode. There's a game mode called 2020-2020, and I'm afraid that if I have to, that if I play FNAF, I won't be able to um, stop playing the game until I beat 2020-2020 mode, even though I have zero skill whatsoever in that type of gameplay. What are you doing? We bought some clay. I'm gonna fix you up. Stay still. Huh? No. Leave me alone. I don't need to be fixed. Sheesh. Stay still, will you? Anne, need some help here. There's a reason why my creator called me a failure. Don't even try to fix me. I said... Uh-huh. Leave me alone. Got a certain monster here. Failure. Oh. So the first sculpture is success, and this sculpture is failure. Just telling me to save right here. Okay. Oh no! I got killed! What a, what a wonder. Can I just run past it if it does that? I messed up. So it moves one step faster than me, but I can't just walk. So it's gotta be precise in my key movements, I guess. So maybe if I hit shift right when that happens, I can get more precise. I can't run into the puddle though. So I guess I just have to like really just get it right the first time. Ah, dang. Oh, oh, okay. I see what I did. I just don't have to run down just that. I messed up. Okay, here we go. Here we go. And a go. Hopefully my mic doesn't cut out again. That would suck. Yeah, okay. That's much easier. What am I... Oh! The top one. I see. Oh! I guess that works too. <sighs> really? <coughs> You're gonna do me like that, game? It's not my fault your controls are jank. Okay, so I'm supposed to, like... Ah, this is just frame perfect. I did it wrong. Yeah. I have to run straight down and then right. One, two, three. And then down and then left. Oh! Oh, I see. Okay. I got it. I got it. I know I did the draw. I mean, so draw is really not, re not really my fault. Probably. Hmm. One and done, two and a foo, three and a four and a whoop up 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 up. <laughs> Even when I'm running, I'm still doing a puzzle game. Yeah, this game isn't scary. But it is fun. I'll be a little hokey. Oh, really? Come on. Left and down and right. I messed up. I did, yep. 
Can I just go straight left though from there? Like perception, my like perception's telling me like. Dad, where are you going? <laughs> it's fine though. It's fine. And we can use those boxes to slow him down. Oh, that by daylight. Gotcha. Cool as cucumber. Ah, I did wrong. Oh. Oh, you know what? I would much rather save here. That would be that would be nice. Thank you for giving me the option, game. I appreciate it. Okay. I like having options in video games. Yeah, I, I hit many things. Alright, here we go. Once more, into the breach. Ah, that was too slow. That was way too slow. Yep. Oof. Precision, precision. That's the name of the game. So yeah. If you look at my precision skills right now, I don't think I can do 2020 mode in uh, FNAF. With any type of... Are you serious? With any type of, like, um, fluency. Please not without sacrificing my Genshin hours, which, you know, they're Genshin hours. What are you gonna do? I could do it though. Like, if I really convinced myself that I was just playing it casually. Or I could play one of the the not as hard games. Like I could try playing um, Pizzeria Simulator and nothing else. Can't be that was a thing. Alright. One. Two. Three. Yeah, that was too slow. Okay. My fingers hurt. One. Two. Three. Up, down, right, up, and up. And... Ah! Gosh dang it, these controls! The dash function was not made for precision. Hang on, let me see if I can change those options. Alright, let's try this. See, when I do it without the dash, I'm messing up more. Okay, hang on. I believe I didn't move. That's on me, that's on me. Finally! Oh no. Are you serious? Are you kidding me? It's going so slowly. It knows what it's doing. It's just building tension. Fake tension! Survive the sculpting department. Looks like the thing is no longer chasing us. 
Hmm? <coughs> Dan, are you okay? Yeah, I'm sorry too. Let's rest for a bit, okay? What do you mean by all of them? Yes, you heard me. She failed all of them. Every single subject. And how is that even possible? If you paid more attention to her, maybe you would have known. Paid more attention? Do you think I had the time for that? I'm the one with the job, working hard for this family. Without me, both of you would have run in the streets. Your job is to take care of her. Oh, great. Here we go again. You're the one who's home all the time. Can't bother to help her with her studies. You think I never tried? You know our daughter is different. I told you to send her to the sash. I told you to send her... I told you to send her to special needs school, but you didn't listen. For the millionth time, there's nothing wrong... For the millionth time, there's nothing wrong with her! She's a slow learner. See? Exactly what I said earlier. If you paid more attention to her, then you would have known there was something wrong with her. Why don't you admit your bad parenting? No! You... Responsibility! How dare you! Listen here! I'm leaving. She's all yours. I don't care what you want to do with her. Well, I don't want to take care of her either. I'm done with both of you. I'm leaving too. Send her to your relatives or whatever. My family wants nothing to do with her. Oh, poor Anne. Gotta send her to the orphanage. Generational trauma! Hey, you're awake. What's wrong? Didn't get enough sleep? Look kind of pale. You okay? And if you need more rest, just say so. Don't force yourself. And I promise I'll get you out of here, so please don't worry too much, okay? Hey, let's go, man. Jesus Christ. Oh, wow, that was... That's really bad for my audio. <laughs> but, um... Be a big old nope for me, boss. Oh well, I guess I fix it towards the end. <laughs> Hopefully, tomorrow's stream will be a bit better with the uh, audio quality, and for Thursday's stream. <clears throat> yep, let's go, Anne. Job security guard. Why do I decide to work on security guard despite everything that's going on with the school? Well, the principals employed me to be a failsafe in case any students break the school rules when in the school after midnight. <laughs> the chances are very slim, but yeah, and here you are. I have to make sure that anyone who ends up here gets out safely. Besides, there's no way I can just ignore everything that's going on, right? Is there anything else I can do? Oh, right. And there's something I forgot to tell you. Oh, uh, you see. Time works differently in this place. I'm not entirely sure, but from my observations while patrolling this place, I can safely assume it changed from day to day. There was one day when it took just an hour for morning to come, and another when it took 48 hours. It was a horrible experience. So, if we're lucky, maybe morning will arrive soon. Anyway, we still have to find the exit in case the worst case scenario happens. Hmm. 
I guess you don't know what's happening with failure then. No, I'm not going back there. Oh. Ghost ladies are following us. That's fine. Well, I think this is a good place to pause. The game is very short so far. Really, what's causing me to like take a lot of time on it is just me getting stuck on puzzles. Um, and getting used to these controls. Seems to be very precise for an RPG Maker game, which I was not expecting. So, <clears throat> we're gonna pause things here. RPG Maker games, I should say. So... Uh, for both the YouTube video and the stream, because I feel like this editing will only be one video. This is goodbye for now. And uh, let's see where we find ourselves at the end of this particular story. I'm going to have to look back at my video to see if all of my audio is completely shot. <coughs> Which, if it is, might mean I would have to do some ADR or possibly some visual editing to make it seem more full. I would like you to keep in mind and remember that Decaf NVIDIA is created under Creative Commons Attribution, Non-Commercial Share Alike, 4.0 International License. You can ring my bell, ring my bell.